Today, I'm gonna be surviving 30 days of professional lion dance training. So I was going through Facebook the other day and I realized it was almost Chinese New Year. And as I was going through the same old Chinese New Year memes, I stumbled upon this video, extreme lion dance stunts. Next thing you know, I was on a two hour lion dance TikTok binge. In fact, I was so mesmerized that I immediately hopped on Google to search if there were any lion dancing schools in my area. I was that obsessed. And I got one result, tucked away and hidden in this sketchy industrial park next to the railroads. But I had to go. So I went up, knocked on the door, and no one responded. Then knocked again, and this guy came out. Are you guys doing lion dancing here? We're closed right now. We're only for private uh, training. But I wasn't gonna give up without a fight. I explained to him how badly I want to try line dancing, and he saw the passion in my eyes, and he said, All right, try it tomorrow, 7 p.m., bring one partner. Thank you, thank you. He got it! All right, let's go! <laughs> one partner? He said, the problem is I only have two friends, and I told him they were both my besties. I don't know how to pick between them, so I told them both to come to the tryout. This was finally my chance to become a line dancer. My name is Ash McKenzie, and I've been doing line dance for probably about 15 years. Today, we're going to be taking the Canto Mando team through a bunch of challenges to push these guys to their paces in traditional line dance. What are you expecting from line dance training? Fun and a lot of blood and sweat. It looks like a very like physically strenuous activity, so it's definitely going to be tough. I don't think it's going to destroy me, though. So I think I'll be pretty ready for it. All right, I hope you guys are ready for our first challenge. To test you guys' jumping ability, we're going to do box jump. But well, we're going to throw a twist in it. So we have Roy, who's the 2017 world champ in world Shanghai. Champ. Whoa! Yeah. I'm Roy. Uh, I've been doing line dance for 13 years since I was 8 years old. So what we want to see is who can get to 30 box jumps first. Go! When you're a lion head, you have to jump multiple times throughout the show. So we're gonna check these guys to make sure that they're able to perform multiple jumps. Oh, I'm gonna win, guys. As I was binge watching lion dance videos that day, I started to realize how cool and rich of a history it had. Did you know that lion dancing had been around for over a thousand years? Ever since some of the early dynasties. For the first time, it made me realize that Chinese New Year wasn't just about taking free money. There are actually so many traditions that I've overlooked and so many aspects to my culture that I didn't even know about. I wanna be the best among Mike and Edward because it's my time to shine. Like, oh When I fell on the box jumps, I, in my head, I, I actually it's all over. I, I was like, I think it's done. Oh yeah, did I fail to mention to you guys that we only need a one lion for Chinese New Year? Okay. So there's three of you. That means one of you guys is gonna get cut. What? Wait, so we're not all gonna make it if we do if we do well? No. And, and you're gonna be the judge, right? Yes. And you saw that fall? I saw. I thought it was a backflip, but. <laughs> What? Cut? Ash went on to tell us that whoever passed this trout would join their team to perform for one of their Chinese near performances. So there is no way I can get cut now. Plus, I already told my parents I was trying out for this lion dance thing, and they were so excited and proud about it. You guys gotta be focused. Here we go. And up. All right, for a second challenge, we're gonna have the guys hold the plyo box over their head. The plyo box will represent a lion head. How's it going? Going good, good for you? Always like yeah. a tree. Man's a, man's a like trooper. It's like an oak tree. You guys are down 45 seconds more. Dude, this thing was f***ing <laughs> heavy. I was trying to play cool, but man, this is hard. How in the world is Mike and Edward holding up for this long? I think Edward has been beat in terms of like athletic ability, but I have more heart. My main advantage today is definitely my athleticism. My advantage is uh, more so balance. See Edward moving a bit. Ah, uh, wasn't trying. You feel like giving up, dog? I'm not gonna give up. Good. I'm not gonna give up. Bet on me, guys. <laughs> oh my god, my arms are shaking. <laughs> 15 seconds. Woo! Five, four, three, two, and die. Oh. Wow, all you guys made it. That was good. All right, our next challenge is horse stance. So since line dance has a lot of kung fu in it, we want to see how strong your stance is. Now, I know you guys did some Shaolin training, so you already have practice doing this. We have some sticks for you guys. You're going to beat us with it? Oh, no. Maybe. Three. Two, and down. So we're gonna get you guys mimicking holding the lion head by having your right hand in a fist and your left hand underneath as if you're holding the lion mouth. It's falling down. That's ah. probably because you're shaking a lot. Oh. Who do you think is gonna get cut and why? Personally, I'd probably say Sheldon probably get cut. Kat talks a little bit too much. Sheldon, yeah, you yeah. go pretty hard. Yeah, you just, just keep going straight up. Uh, I think Mike's gonna get cut because Sheldon and Edward, they have great calves. This horse stance is so freaking hard. This is a total weakness of mine. I also think that Ash might have, you know, placed it poorly on me. I'm you have to go completely parallel. Wait, oh! 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 
Oh my leg. Everybody, I think you got it. You easily oh got it. Whoa. Oh and still not moving. Wow. Thank goodness that Mike died because otherwise I would have been up first for sure. All right, here we are at our fourth challenge. So this one's gonna be a partner challenge. The next exercise is a variation of our horse stance. So this would be our typical stance for a lion jump. But this time we're gonna have the boys team up and hold each other up in horse stance. Go. Oh my god! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I can't, okay. I can't, bro, yo. Wait, 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 Are you guys good? Let's go! Oh, yeah, we're, we're getting back. there, we're getting there. Let's try again. All right, if I eat your ass, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> what? What? You guys ready? Go. That's good. Let's go, team! Oh! Oh! oh. Mike, you're coming back into I know, okay, okay. You gotta pull me into you. Okay, they're asking for, asking for one more. Do you wanna give them one more? All right, all right, I get it, I get it. I wanna make the line dance team because I told my dad, and he's like, oh, I'm so proud of you, son. I've never gotten I'm proud of you, son, from my dad before. So I gotta, I gotta make the line dance team. It's almost Chinese New Year's, and I feel like every year I just kind of receive red pockets, but maybe this year I'm able to actually give something back to my parents. Okay, go. Okay. Oh. You know what? This time I'm moving the boxes out. This is it. During this exercise, I was glad to see that they started to build some teamwork. These guys sort of came around and figured out a strategy. So that's what I like to see. Sheldon's shaking really hard. And, uh, my team's pretty uh, stable. <laughs> Yep, Lion Dance definitely built some teamwork, all right. Some really good team bonding definitely going on here. Oh my god, my thighs! Oh! oh. oh. Hey, yo, yo, my thighs, man. All right, since, since you gave him another try, do you wanna, do you wanna... One more? Do you think you deserve the same? Yes. Let's go. Yes. All right. Okay, here we go. You guys are up. This round looks more relaxed. Like, you guys have a little bit more confidence. Who do you think is going to get cut? Uh, I, th I think Sheldon. I think Sheldon's going to get cut. Sheldon's falling behind. That one fall is, uh, might be a big mistake, but I think he can come back from it. All I need to do is hold Roy longer than Mike and we'd be even. Ash has been growing me the entire time and I know what he's thinking. Why isn't Ken Amanda one of those subs yet? People should definitely subscribe and help them out to get to their goal. Anyway, if I want to make the Lion Dance team and be able to make my parents proud, this was the defining moment. Ah. <sighs> Good job, guys. Good job, guys. You guys can see uh, Sheldon's determination. Look at his legs. He has Roy's <laughs> footprints in them. At this point, I know. I cannot mess up again. I've failed almost all the challenges so far, and if I don't make it on this team, then I have to go back and tell my parents that I won't be becoming a lion dancer. And the thing is, I know if I can surprise them with this lion dance performance, I know it'll really make them smile seeing their son embrace his culture like this. I already know Edward's gonna make it. I cannot lose to Mike. I had to treat this as if I were in the Olympics. The Olympics? What a perfect segue! For this video, we partnered on a campaign to help promote the 2022 Beijing Winter Olympics. You see, because I'm Canadian, every four years I tune in for the Winter Olympics. Because that's all we do here. Watch hockey and drink maple syrup. Jokes aside, I love how the Winter Olympics brings people together from all across the world. This year's Winter Olympics are taking place between February 4th to February 20th, with the Paralympic Games starting between March 4th to March 13th. It's gonna be happening in Beijing, which means it's gonna be the world's first dual Olympic city. Kinda cool, right? To address the health concerns, they've created advanced healthcare technology to make sure everyone stays safe during the games. As well, low climate impact technology will power all event venues using clean energy from renewable sources like solar and wind. This will be the first time in Olympic history that all venues will be powered by green energy. That's not it though. There's gonna be seven brand new events, such as women's monobob, men's and women's freestyle skiing, and mixed team ski jumping, among others. I know what you're thinking, Lion Dance is unfortunately not one of them, because if it was, I'd be right there winning gold. Wait. <laughs> I haven't even qualified for this team yet. <laughs> Anyway, let me tell you the coolest part. You know on this channel we're all about embracing and being proud of our culture, right? Well, the Beijing 2022 game starts on February 4th. And you know what else starts early February? Only the most important holiday in a lot of cultures, including my own, Lunar New Year! Yay, red pocket time! This year, it's the Year of the Tiger, which symbolizes bravery, strength, and courage. So what better way to celebrate the new year than tuning into the games and cheering on your country's athletes? Let us know what winter sport you'll be tuning into, who you're cheering for, and best of luck to all athletes. Now back to the tryouts. Edward, you know what you should be grabbing right now? No, I, just, I, I can't even grab that for one. No, you, you should be grabbing culture. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, here we go. Boxes are being moved. 
All right, this is going to take a lot of focus, the way you guys are standing. Oh my god, my calves, bro. Oh my god. Bro. Oh! oh. <laughs> I can't move. Roy was stable as a tree. And carrying Sheldon, he's not light. My, my legs actually felt like they were falling apart. I actually had no idea like how, how I held it on for so long. So since you guys like partner work so much, I think we should do one more challenge. So we call this kick butt, where the lion head has to jump up and wrap their legs around the tail. Oh. It's titanic. Lift. Okay, boxes are gone. So this is gonna be a challenge for both the lion head and tail to see who has focus, power, and determination to keep the position. These guys are very quiet for the first time. Ugh. If I didn't last long on the mic, I knew I'd be out. I knew the whole dream would be dead. All right, this motherfucker Roy, what <laughs> did he eat before coming to this challenge? It felt like I was holding the Eiffel Tower, but I had to hold on because this is my final chance and I could not let this opportunity slip. And they're down. And I f***ing let it slip. Do you guys not see? I slipped right on the floor, right there. I slipped on the floor. It's the, sh it's, it's the floor. My legs are so tired. First it's kind of cool, you're like, oh man, he's floating. And then you're like, oh my god, he weighs so much. Well, then you gotta redeem yourself now. Blind dance, no joke. Oh! Feel pretty good. Yeah. I feel really beautiful. I feel really beautiful. Oh, Titanic ship sinking. No, 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 my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 dude. Oh, Why'd yeah. you go for the thrust? Oh. Why'd you go for the oh. thrust? Bro, that was awesome. So what do you guys think right now? It's easier being a tail or the head? It's way easier being a head. Head. All right, for sure. Yeah, being a tail sucks. Yeah. But, 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 if, if, you know, if we get a tail, you know, I'm willing to, I'm willing to be a tail. So I'll put that, I'll put that out there. All right. All right, here we are at the end of our first day and we completed all of our challenges. I'm gonna need to pick two dancers. So only two of you can make the cut. I'm gonna need someone as a lion tail and someone as a lion head. The person that's a tail has to be really strong. I think this one's a no-brainer. Edward. Yeah, lion tail. You are now the lion tail. In order to be a good lion head, you have to have powerful arms. You must have a lot of determination and to be able to stay focused. This one's very challenging to pick. Both of you guys did an excellent job. Mike is clearly the stronger person. However, Sheldon has a lot of good enthusiasm. So do we pick power or do we pick enthusiasm and willingness to learn? So I think Jason has some faith in uh, Sheldon and he thinks he'll make a good head. So we're gonna go with Sheldon as the lion head. Thank you, thank you. Oh, John, John, how much do you weigh? I weigh 160. One diet, bro. <laughs> All right, so this is going to be our team. So we're going to see if they work together. Hey. Hey. But don't worry, Mike. I got a role for you. 